Don't get a shot of that ugly potato. That's the most vegan. No! That's the most vegan thing of me. I think it's actually been there for like three weeks too. Dirty half sweet potato? Oh. <laughs> so today I wanted to film a little what I eat in a day video. I know you guys love seeing them, but I feel like I always film those videos when I'm just like at home eating regular food and I don't have much going on. But the reality is our lives are busy. I'm always running around. So today I thought I would take you guys along on a very busy day and share with you guys what I eat out in a day. Of course, I want to thank today's video sponsor, Crave. Crave has a bunch of amazing TV shows and original series as well. There's actually a new series, Healthy is Hot, which is a Crave original starring Chloe Wilde. I've been obsessed with this series. There's one episode in particular that talks about eating plant-based, eating sustainable, all that fun stuff. So I actually had a chance to sit down with the star, Chloe Wilde, and we chatted a bit more about it, and that really just inspired today's episode. So. Let's roll that footage last week. You came from a background of not being a vegan, but then also got to learn and experience and eat so many different sustainable food options. Not a vegan, mm -hmm. but I definitely try to have meatless days right. in my diet. Like meatless Mondays is a great mm -hmm. opportunity. So when I went into this, I kept thinking to myself, like, is this gonna be tasty? I right. was being brought on this amazing food crawl with Erin Ireland, and she brought me to the most exquisite spots. Like everything mm -hmm. I ate blew my mind. We went to an animal sanctuary. I was just rubbing this pig's belly and yeah. she was so happy and she like lied on her side and I just started talking to the pig and apologizing for all the bacon that I've eaten yeah. and just kind of really connecting with this animal and being like I can't eat you anymore and like right. I can't eat you because I love you and you have feelings and you just want to have a belly rub. It's not just about the animals it's also about the environment and we're living in a time when like everyone needs to step up when it comes to the environment. So if you can, you know, be like me and have some more plant-based meals in your diet, not only are you doing really good things for your body, but you're also helping out Mother Earth. And Mother Earth is a bit we of a We gotta live here, so we gotta, yeah. we gotta make sure yeah. it's rolling right. We'll make sure we link the episode down below. You guys will have to check it out. I feel like I get into the routine of eating at home or eating the same meals. Like, you know, it's, it's easy, it's your routine, but I do have a busy day ahead of me next week. So I thought I was gonna kind of go to all the restaurants, try out all the new foods. You need to wear stretchy pants. Take it from me. Oh yeah, no, we will be in uh, <laughs> stretchy tights. Do not be confused. <laughs> I need my makeup to last all day. Whatever I leave the house looking like, that's just what I'm looking like for the rest of the day. I'm gonna need to pack literally probably four different outfits because we're filming a podcast episode two and then I just like comfy clothes when I'm not on camera. So there's a, there's a variety really going on. Hydration station, baby. No, this is, this is bad. You know, you just throw everything down. You're like, I don't want to deal with it. It's bad. I'm going to clean it tonight. I'm going to clean it tonight. I also have a bit of a shoot problem. Okay. I'm already sweating. Gear. Whew. Let's start the day. I normally am just running around with my bags, but sitting down is nice. Kale, banana, pear, lime, ginger, hemp, and mint. The green of the smoothie. Be happier the girl. And don't be confused, these are compostable. Okay, so I just have my little bullet journal here. This is actually um, one that my friend made. I use it all the time. So I'm gonna kind of organize my schedule. This is like where I like to kind of set up the day and make sure that it doesn't get too crazy because I know it's gonna get crazy. So I'm gonna get through that, have a little smoothie, and then I'll hit the road soon and get to kickboxing. So I definitely couldn't eat anything more than this before I work out because it'll just be too heavy. Like a perfect little smoothie before. Tell me that's the secret. Only five minutes late. The worst is when I'm running late though, and then I have to like do this in under 10 seconds. Ponytail, secured. Oh, oh. Yeah. Yeah, that felt good. Whew. Ah, that was too big. Okay, let's do it for real. Okay, kickboxing done. I need to like make myself look half decent. And I just realized I forgot to bring my like makeup to touch up for everything else today. We're gonna head to Fresh. Fresh is like my favorite restaurant of all time. I eat there literally, actually probably too often. I think majority of my income goes directly back to that restaurant. It's an amazing plant-based restaurant. Let's go eat. <laughs> that didn't work. I wanted it to be like, I'm gonna do a little lunch and work, get through some emails and just some like housekeeping stuff. I'm gonna order some of my favorite food because girls gotta eat. Thank you. Oh baby. Okay, so fun fact, the all-star salad is actually the very first vegan meal that I ever had at a vegan restaurant. Must have been like six years ago. The all-star salad. This is a very special place in my heart. It's very nostalgic and just so good. It's actually so crazy. You never know how long replying to comments takes, but it definitely takes a hot minute, but I love it. Like I couldn't not, 
not do it, you know. Oh, tour's almost ready. We'll have to run to the podcast studio soon. We've got a big episode today. There she is. Hello. Oh, fully on the camera. How was your morning? Good, how about you? Yeah, it was good. We were like running around, but it was great. So fun fact about Tori, as much as a carnivore that she is, she loves a Beyond Meat burger now. I do. Slightly converted. Slightly, I like them. It's shocking. Carnivorous. Sorry, that sounds like a plant. Uh, I'll leave. Picture of Patrick, he doesn't want to make noise like a deer in headlights. Oh my gosh, I, I forgot I'm that you were here I'm actually. Sorry. We get to the airport, I'm not kidding. As soon as we get through security, what do we see? A&W, Beyond Meat burgers, and a subway yeah. right next door to each other. Thanks for tuning in. See Thanks, you guys. Time. We'll see you soon. Here, don't forget your camera. Okay, peace out, y'all. Outfit change number three. And we have some jewelry for this one. So this is gonna be fancy. <laughs> Just kidding, it's jeans and a t-shirt. That's my true, true vibe. Okay, so next stop, we're heading to a little showroom. There's a bunch of makeup and clothing pulls that we have to do. I'm actually doing an on-air segment on TV, so I need to pull like some fresh makeup pieces for that. So, what I also did was picked up some surprise cupcakes because it's actually one of the employees' birthdays. So shout out to Megan. We've got some vegan cupcakes and also some, I actually don't know what these are. It's like a meringue. Look at those. And then these are just the little tops, the little peepees. Half of them are cupcakes and half are meringues. But when they're in here, it looks like it's just a top of a cupcake without the bottom. I don't know actually what it is. There might be a cookie on the bottom. Oh, okay. oh. oh no, you did the squish? That is a technique. Oh, <laughs> that's your shot. We're gonna put a slow mo of that. She's not a vegan. I'm so. not a vegan. I like meat too much. But right, it's a good time. it got a it got a thumbs up. Oh yeah, that's Perfect. oh that is for sure the one. Try it smells like a, a juice camera actually, camera. like a fresh, mm -hmm. mm, like juice shop. Seal on that. No, there isn't. I thought <laughs> no, I thought there was a seal. I love but. it so much, but there's a seal. oh there is. <laughs> I love this so. Guys, I have one at home, obviously. Goodies secured, and happy birthday. Bye. See ya. It always feels like a kid in a candy shop. It never gets old. I'm ready for a proper sit down meal. There's something to be said for a nice, peaceful, enjoyable meal versus like, boom, boom, boom. <laughs> you got it. Health as well. I don't know if this counts as health, but <laughs> what is that? Buckwheat? This is goodbye. <laughs> Thank you. That was so fun. I have so many things still. Oh, it gets colder every time. Ah! Oh, what a crazy day this was. I feel like as long as I've got good food, I can get through any busy day. That's like my little motto. Um, but yeah, I think just being conscious of your food choices, food and lifestyle choices, whether you're fully plant-based, you're vegan, or only have a couple of vegetarian days a week, being aware, I think, is really important in having that mindfulness. So anyways, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I do wanna say a huge thank you again to Crave for sponsoring this video. If you want some more plant-powered goodness in your life, I'll link the episode of Healthy is Hot down below. Definitely worth checking out. And yeah, other than that, make sure you guys subscribe, thumbs up, go rewatch the video, get those food moments going again, because those are way too good. And I'll see you guys very soon. Bye.